Welcome everyone, today I'm here in London to get hands on with Doom. Early baby, I'll we'll be playing multiplayer, so today's gonna be awesome. So without further ado, let's get early hands on with this game and see what it's about. Doom multiplayer gameplay. You may not have heard a lot about this brand new edition of Doom, but trust me, after seeing this gameplay, I'm sure it will get you hyped. I was lucky enough to go to an early gameplay event in London, play multiplayer, being some of the first people in the world to get hands on with this game. There's tons of other YouTubers here. You can see all their names on screen. It was awesome playing with them. Today, we're focusing all on multiplayer. I'm going to be showing you guys tons of sniper footage, shotgun footage, crazy melee destruction kills like that, and also things like this. This this is a teleporter grenade. If you teleport into it while an enemy's on it, you'll actually spawn inside them and kill them. <laughs> Got tons of crazy kills to show you guys. But basically, I just want to show you guys how much fun it is. Now, one of the combinations I absolutely love to use was the shotgun and sniper combination. The sniper, the longer you were zoomed in, had a little bit of a charge feature and would deal more damage. So it basically encouraged you to stay zoomed in if you wanted to get those uh, one-hit kills. And then again, you have to aim for the head. The sniper was basically like a very delicate accurate gun, which is what it should be, but it rewarded you massively, and uh, as you saw there just in an earlier clip, if you no-scope people up close, it can still work quite effectively, dealing between like 30 and 40 damage, with each player running around typically around 100 points of health, so gunfights aren't over extremely quickly, and this was super aggressive and super, super accurate. So this game is all about mastering the basics, the movement, the aim, and of course knowing where all the spawns are for the drops on the map as well. But it was a ton of fun, very, very competitive, and all of us are screaming and shouting at each other and absolutely loving it. So you saw there that sniper shot. I got a nice high body shot, almost even a head shot, but it didn't kill. Look at another crazy melee kill. That's because it wasn't zoomed in. It wasn't charged up for long enough. This is one of the sort of super mega weapons you can pick up. It's one of the power-ups around the map. These were not spawning very often. That was the only clip I actually got with the weapon, but I thought I'd show you guys because it was absolutely mad. Now watch this. Threw a teleporter grenade on the ground, pretended to suicide. Willy Rex followed me. I teleported back to where I threw down the grenade, completely surprised him, was so happy when I got this, this kill, man. Like, there's so much creativity you can have with that teleporter grenade. It's absolutely insane. So this is another one of the weapons. This is like the rocket launcher. Uh, most of the players gravitated towards the sniper because although it wasn't necessarily easy to use, it had sort of like, if, if you did get nice shots and were very accurate with it, it was basically one of the most effective weapons to use in the game. But there were tons of different assault rifles, there were laser weapons, and uh, this one was a lot of fun. I used this when I first started playing uh, at the event quite a lot because it, it reminds me of the Rocket Man from TF2, if any of you guys have played TF2. And uh, I absolutely love using the Rocket Man. That guy, that guy knows what he's talking about, baby. Um, here's another one of the weapons, that, one of the au fully auto machine guns. Not too powerful, but um, can fire very quickly. And it's more of sort of like a typical assault uh, auto um, automatic weapon that you'd find within any FPS game as well. So we've shown you guys tons of different variety in terms of weapons. One of the big things, you've probably seen in the thumbnail, I may have heard talk about, is actually one of the demons that spawn in that you can turn into, run around the map, and absolutely mash people up. The big power weapon you saw me get earlier on in the game, these power-ups will spawn around the map. There'll be a countdown and an alert from the announcer letting you know it's going to be coming in soon. And, as you can see in a second, this big demon is absolutely crazy. And if you manage to turn into him, you'd mash people up. So we've had tons of clips of normal weapons. Now, what's this? The demon ruin has spawned. Uh-oh, the enemy has it, however. The demon has tons and tons of health. All of us are firing into him. Eventually, he gets slayed down. I managed to get into the rune first, meaning I get to turn into the demon. I have 300 points of health. Three times the typical player health amount. This is absolutely mad. You can jetpack around. You can use your massive rocket launchers. It is absolutely insane, my friends. And I've got three clips showing you with this as well. I've also got a crazy clip where I managed to kill the demon as well. Using the sniper rifle, using one of the additional power-ups that are available on the map. This game is nuts, man. Now, the beta for this game is actually coming out, I believe, tomorrow. Very, very soon. And I honestly, I cannot wait to jump on and play it. I think I'm going to grab some of the players I was actually playing with at this event. Some of my YouTube buddies. And we're all going to play some multiplayer together. Because it's just one of those sort of simple shooters. There's not too much craziness going on. Although it looks aesthetically very, very crazy. 
It, it's core cool mechanics are actually very simple. Now, I've just picked up a quad damage power up. This is very, very rare. I only got this a few times, but it will trip, uh, sorry, quadruple all of the damage you're about to do. Uh, you can see I'm covered in purple right now. It doesn't last for too long, but it's absolutely insane. Now, this is where the demon comes along. Will you exit the demon? I know scoping. 90 damage. Another ton of damage to him, all because of that quad damage, meaning I kill him, which would normally be an extremely hard kill, obviously killing the demon, and then it's my turn to mash people up, baby! But as I said, once the beta comes out, I definitely want to jump on a plate in my own setup. We were playing on the PC build of the game, but you could use either a controller or a keyboard and mouse. And I wanted to sit here, use a PlayStation 4 controller, play it in my own setup at home, and uh, really just try and get to grips with the game, try and get you guys some mad gameplays. As I said, it's a very simple game, very arcadey. There's only health packs, ammo packs, and armor packs on the ground. And then there's the selection of weapons. It's pretty much just up to you to be as accurate as possible and understand the navigation of the map. And once you get all of those things down, you'll be able to kick butt. So, it's my final clip turning into the Mad Demon, my friends. I believe there's going to be multiple demon options you can turn into when the full game comes out. But this was just like a limited build of the game, basically. Similar to what the, what the beta will be. Uh, but it was still an absolute ton of fun. We played TDM. We also played... Um, this mode right here, very similar to hard point, except the point is actually constantly moving around the map. So you want to capture it by standing inside it. Once you've captured it, then it's up to you to defend it. Make sure the enemies do not get it back. So we're dealing mad damage here, baby. The demon is absolutely going to town. You see the kill feed in the top right. We're just absolutely slaying everybody out. It's too much fun. But if you do die, you'll drop that demon room and somebody else can turn into it. But it will eventually run out. It won't stay on the map forever. You won't have a demon running around on the map forever, guys. Do not worry. Uh, but this was absolutely crazy. I feel sorry for everyone that I killed. But hey, I got killed by a, by a lot as well. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this early look at Doom multiplayer gameplay. Let me know what you think down below in the comment section. I'd say get involved in the beta if you can and give it a go because I'm sure you'll absolutely love it. But hopefully you've enjoyed this early gameplay. Let me know what you think. Check out more videos on screen and I'll see you guys tomorrow as always with another video.